Some people are born with an entrepreneurial spirit. Others marry into it. Mark Zinke and Marv Peterson proved that a business born by accident can not only flourish, but also inspire others. Emmeline Ivey has their story. He's not a Gutenberg, but ink runs through Mark Zinke's blood. I do all the graphic designing, all the printing myself. What they print on has come a long way from parchment, and so has Zinke's business. When I started, I had like three designs on three t-shirts, and I thought I was just going to have them in the shop in Mandan and maybe do one or two vendor shows. Um, but now I have it, obviously I'm here in the mall, I have it in the mall now, and online store. For Zinke, this is where the magic happens. It's where he chooses the mesh screens that'll create the designs of his next hit. A little ink, some help from a high-tech printing press, and Zinke's newest shirt is ready to leave the locker room in Mandan to hit the sales floor at the sister store in Kirkwood Mall. And Zinke gets some help hanging his merch from his father-in-law, Marv Peterson, who owns the store. I've been in business for 15 years. It started as a retirement gig for me. Uh, I bought a little tiny trophy shop and um, then it turned into a silk screening shop. That's how it started. I mean, just being in the screen printing game and helping him out, that's where I got my passion for it. Thus, a pure gear was born. And between the racks of locally produced sports apparel, it's hard to miss Zinke's shirts. They all revolve around a similar theme. I think it's cool to be from North Dakota and to be proud of being from North Dakota. And there's not a lot of things like this where you can represent your state like that. Each design proves three things to be true. Peterson knows sports, Zinke loves the Peace Garden State, and ink runs through both their veins. In Bismarck and Mandan, I'm Emmeline Ivey for your News Leader. Zinke says Up Here Gear Apparel was just accepted for a wholesale with a large U.S. company, and he plans to scale into more stores. He says he's also working on lifestyle-focused designs.